Ladies and gentlemen, it's your old pal Husky Dork welcoming you back for episode three of my SmackDown Here Comes the Pain Raw series. And last week, we got ourselves a manager. And not just any manager, a Hall of Famer. That's right, we got Trish Stratus on our side. And we're getting some Stratus faction this week. Already paying dividends, getting a win over future world champion, multiple time world champion, Randy Orton. So now we're in Raw, third week of May, from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Let's go ahead and let's fire up Monday Night Raw. Oh, it's Christian. Okay. What you're looking for here, Captain Charisma? Hey, Husky. Thanks to you, I think I lined up for a little treat tonight. Nice work. What are you talking about, dude? Anyway, the Trish is one hot chick, you know. Oh, is this another one of these deals where someone's gonna steal my manager? I already had some homemade pie. No, I haven't yet. Here comes the sex joke. I'd love to get some of my hands on some of her pie myself. <laughs> Real funny, Cricket. <laughs> Take it easy, I'm only joking for now. Eh. Whatever. Oh, backstage you got Randy Orton. So the not yet Viper. Let's go talk to him. Hey, Randy, what do I want? Hey, I'm just here to gloat, man. I beat you again. I mean, I keep on schooling you every time I face you. Looking for an ass kicking? Oh, like the one you didn't give me last week? Husky dork and Randy. Oh, it's the chairman. Hi, Vince. What the hell are you guys doing just fraternizing backstage? Uh, just a little friendly conversation. Last week, I showed plenty of ruthless aggression. Well, Vince, you hate my guts, so I'll take any sort of compliment, backhanded or otherwise. Why don't I keep it good work? Aw, oh, thanks, Dad. I mean, Vince. Vince has high expectations of you. And then Kevin Dunn will bury them all. All right, Monday Night Raw, and hey, take a look. Yours truly not booked. Yet, for some reason, I have a feeling I'm going to be involved in the Trish Stratus Jazz match, so why don't we go ahead and give that a look-see tonight on Monday Night Raw. All right, here we go. Trish Stratus, way better than Jazz. I don't know what she's doing. Oh, she got me there. Ooh, and then a big kick and a drop kick that somehow she stopped mid-air. I don't know how that happened. All right, here we go. Trish, can she get the better of a takedown? A nice uh, arm drag, oh, but eats a drop kick from the women's champion, Jazz. So Jazz is now going to work on Trish Stratus. And Trish trying to escape out of this submission. And that's all she can do. And then now, another arm drag. And then, oh, a flying head scissor. And Trish is gloating. Not going for a chick kick? No, it doesn't happen. And instead, a drop kick sends Jazz to the ground. And a big elbow there. Oh, and another drop kick from Jazz. But, oh, there's a... Oh. Jazz got the better of that one. And now... Oh, what a DDT. Oh. Just a big old face buster. Just slamming the face right to the mat. And then a reverse neck breaker from Trish. Here's a cover. Not even a one camp. And then nice arm drag. Oh, but that drop kick again. Hurting Trish. Oh, 
And then another arm drag, and it's not really having much effect. One, two. two, and Trish is able to get out. And now Fireman's carry into a flip. Oh. What a maneuver. Turnbuckle smash. Cover to... Oh, just got a shoulder up there. And here she goes again. Fireman's carry into that front. Splash there. And again, just a one. Just a one camp. Trish trying again and flying head scissor. Oh, and a big bulldog. Could this be it? One, two, and Jazz able to get up. And now, ooh, jawbreaker there. Here's a cover for Trish. Is that going to be enough? No, shoulder up at two by the women's champ. And now she's going for the chick kick. Big time chick kick. And that should do it. Two. Three. And Trish Stratus is victorious on Raw. And Trish is victorious. Big win for her over the women's champ tonight. And now here comes Husky looking to get on the action. I'm glad you were here to support me, Husky. Thank you so much. Hey, no problem. Uh, I was just going through your suitcase in the locker room smelling up your drawers. <laughs> I, I hope that's okay. Uh, I hope it's all right. Uh, I'll give her a hug. Sure, why not? Oh, there we go. Yeah, once you go fat, you never go back. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> not appropriate. Oh, it's more than appropriate. Hey, I can get all, trying to get any action that I can right now, all right? Before uh, cock blocking JR gets in the way. I might have just crossed the borders of just being a wrestler manager here. Oh, okay. Well, here comes JR, the uh, cold bucket of water to uh, throw on this flame. All right. So that was a big win for Trish Stratus. Next up, we've got an Intercontinental Championship match. Booker T, the Intercontinental Champion, taking on nine time. Nine time. I'm not going to do it nine times. It's Chris Jericho. And Booker T is actually still the Intercontinental Champ. And then in a match, oddly placed for a main event. It's a cage match. It's Devon Dudley versus Christian. With Christian getting victorious. So that's Monday Night Raw for the third week of May. All right, the final Monday Night Raw for the month of May comes to you from Tupelo, Mississippi. What is Husky Dork going to do to uh, advance with the Trish Stratus? Let's go ahead and find out. Monday Night Raw. Oh, it's it's Trish. Hey, hey Trish, how's it going? I see that you're uh, near my favorite place, the vending machine. Dot, dot, dot. Okay, very thoughtful and insightful what you just said there. What's wrong with you? What are you staring at? You're making me blush. Aw, oh, really? Because the uh, restraining order would say otherwise. Excuse me, folks. I'm here to uh, make your penis soft here. Gonna just nip this one right in the bud. Yeah, pretty much. Awkward, awkward times here. I thought providing you a manager would be good for your career. I didn't think you guys would get too personal with each other. Well, why don't you take a look at her, Ross, okay? I know that she doesn't get your uh, get your business up, but you know what? You don't have to prevent other people from doing that, all right? Understand where I'm getting at? No, I don't. 
Because as far as I know, you're some sort of sexual deviant. So I have no idea why you're just jumping in front of this. So why don't you guys remember to keep your relationship professional. Okay, well why don't you talk to Triple H and Stephanie about that, alright? Or uh, Ronnie Mac and Jazz when she's not uh, hitting on me. Or Lita and... Well, yeah, it would be Matt Hardy still in this game. Lita and Matt Hardy, I'm sure they're keeping it real professional. And I'm sure when Edge gets with Lita, he's going to make it even more professional. Yeah, make a good pair. Sure. Like toe jam and butter. Wait, what? Very happy you two have found each other. Oh, well, thanks, Jim. I appreciate that. Don't you have some place to be? Anyway, congratulations. I'm just going to awkwardly stand here and stare at you for a little while thinking contemplating that I'm gonna go back and rub my nipples later remember husky be careful don't worry okay she's not even gonna let me touch her aside from a hug Trish is one of our top divas oh yeah definitely not gonna ruin that if you mistreat her then you're asking for trouble all right, I got gotcha. you. Ha ha ha! See you later, folks. What a dick! Yeah, come on, Jr. All right, taking a look, I go one on one with Christian this week on uh, Monday Night Raw. So let's go ahead and let's. Uh, Hey, you know, anything can happen on Monday Night Raw. Let's see what we can do. Alright, here we go. Facing Christian. Oh, man, he missed that drop kick. Oh, but he got me big time there. Can I get him? No, he got the best of me on that. With the reverse uh, neck breaker. And now Christian going to work, and he's going to make short work of me, I'm sure. And oh no, Husky! Oh, and a big boot as well! And drove a nice fist in there as well. That didn't sound right. Punches in bunches. The name of the game here with Husky leading into a big spine buster. And a missed opportunity on the fist drop and a knee to the gut. Need a Husky's big gut. And then, oh man, gut buster right there. Draped it. Ooh, going low. Oh, but Christian counters. And another knee to the gut, and Husky is hurting. Can I actually get a move on Christian? I can. And that's what happens there. How about a nice suplex? Right to Christian. Oh, fist bump doesn't work. And now Christian throws me out and throws me back in. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Backbreaker from Christian. Multiple time tag champion, multiple time intercontinental champion. Big leg drop. And a missed fist drop. And a belly to belly suplex from Husky. And a fist drop. And now Christian, oh boy, just draping the throat right on the middle rope and no idea what this is going to be. No rope break. Interesting. And then a side Russian leg sweep. Husky going to try and go for it? No, he's going to try for the leg drop instead. Come on, Husky. Double underhook suplex. And now draping his throat under the bottom rope. 
Big maneuver there. And now gonna go for punches. Punches in bunches to Christian. Cover? No. One count and that was it. And then Christian gets a nice move and a discus clothesline. Husky Dork flipping him over and more punches. And now I'm gonna go for the Windy Richter scale. This could be Husky's biggest win so far in his return. Here's a cover. Go for a cover, young man. I can't believe that. Unbelievable. He is mauling Christian, saying that's what you get for dealing with my woman. Cover rope break. Oh, and now that kick has busted Christian open. And here's a cover. <laughs> oh, a one count. And now a double underhook suplex. And a big splash. But a rope break occurs. And that is another big boot to Christian. And look at Husky just laying it down. Big splash again. Two, three, Husky was pissed. You envy me. Okay, what's this about? Having Trish by your side, uh-huh. But I'm going to put an end to my envy. Oh, is that right? I'm going to kick some ass tonight and steal her away from you. Oh, man. What a dick. Now, accept my challenge. What, you want to get beat up again? All right, Christian. We could do that. I accept. They don't get me wrong. I'm not disrespecting her by trying to win her over by fighting you. I'm going to have a match with her instead. Aw, oh, what a... that That's not cool. What the hell's going on around here? Better watch your own back around here, Trish. Unbelievable and disgusting. Christian, not man enough to fight Husky again, instead wants to face Trish. Absolutely disgusting. How dare he? What a coward. Christian, absolute coward. Well, now we got all these other matches out on the heels of that. We start off first, Shawn Michaels, Rob Van Dam taking on Triple H and Rodney Mack. That's a weird pairing. And Shawn Michaels gets the pin over Rodney Mack. Yeah, someone was going to job there. And it was going to be Rodney Mack. And then the main event, it's going to be Bubba Ray and Goldust taking on Val Venus and Test. A weird elimination tag main event. And it's Bubba Ray Dudley getting the win over Val Venus. So that's the final Raw of May. Let's go to the pay-per-view. Well, ladies and gentlemen, definitely... A good outing for yours truly, uh, moving a little bit closer to something with Trish and getting a huge win over Christian, leading into Christian's match against uh, Trish at the Judgment Day pay-per-view. I can't help but think that it might be the Batista-Lita situation all over again, but that's for another day. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the the episode please feel free to give a like uh, below if you enjoyed it so much you want to share with friends please hit that share button and of course don't forget to subscribe so you get the latest videos once again thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time